Hey guys, how's it going? It is Mr. Crayfish and welcome back to Furniture Friday, your favorite day of the week. Now, if you don't know how Furniture Friday works, basically I release a brand new update to my furniture mod every single week and uh, usually it is a brand new piece of furniture and uh, today we are going to be revealing a brand new piece of furniture. Actually two of them, actually three of them. So get hyped right now because we have a lot to get through. But before we do start, I just want to let you guys know real quick that I'm actually streaming over on Twitch now. Um, so if you guys would love to see the development of my furniture mod, vehicle mod, and all the other mods, go follow me. I'll put a link in the description below. But anyway, let's head over to Craig here right now and uh, check out these brand new changes. So to get to Craig here, we are actually going to be taking the brand new off-roader truck in the latest update of my vehicle mod. Go download it right now. I'll also put a link in the description for it below. Um, but this thing is an absolute beast. I love this thing. Incoming! <laughs> oh god. Are they, have they got car parking spots big enough for this? I don't think they do. Oh, we might have to. Oh, here we go. Here we go. It's alright, I'm staff here. I'm staff, I can take the spot. So have a look here, we have four crates to open. I should say one is actually a chest. However, three of them are new features uh, compared to one here which is actually just a minor change. So this is basically a content update today guys. It's a content update. Only new stuff being added to the furniture mod today. No changes at all. So let's grab out the crowbar here and let's start going through the crate. So first one, change one. Let's do it right now. In three, two, one. Ah, I love opening that first crate. That first sound is beautiful. Have a look at this. So we have the modern couch. Now, what is different about it? Well, if you actually look closely, the textures of it have changed. Ah, crayfish. I can't believe you've done this. Well, there is a good reason behind this texture change, my dudes. So, first of all, let's just take a look at it real quickly. So, basically, as you can see, there's a decent amount of textures that have changed on this. So, no longer does it actually use the wood texture. Technically, it is still wood. It's just kind of, you know, colored. It's got like a, you know, it's like a fake wood texture over the top of it but but basically we got gray kind of texture here we have white and then we also have this kind of red smooth texture it no longer uses the wool texture for it so basically these are kind of I would say looking more modern and uh, you'll realize uh, once we open up those two crates there why I've actually changed these around and it will make a whole lot more sense so We'll just place a couple of these down just so you guys can get a look at them, but they're actually still really cool. I'm not going to lie. I still think they look awesome with these textures here, but you, 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 you'll you get a better understanding in a second here. So let's go ahead. Let's get rid of those. Um, we do need the crowbar, but we don't need it for this next one because this next one is a little bit different. And you're probably wondering why it's actually in a chest, and it's because this kind of new... You know, new piece. It's not really. It's an existing piece of furniture, but it's some new variants. So basically, it can't actually go inside another crate. And uh, this new feature is I could just I could just not do it. <laughs> I could just not open this up for ten minutes, and you guys will have to sit here. Jokes. Uh, we have. The brand new variants of the crates. So if you actually looked really, really closely, it's probably really impossible to tell. But um, basically the crates actually looked different. So let's grab out these right now. And you'll see that we now have every single variant of the crate. So we have the oak crates. We have the spruce crates. We have the jungle crates. We have the birch crates. Ugh. What is that thing? What is that? What is this abomination? We have the acacia and then we finally have the dark oak. Have a look at these guys. So this was something in the uh, making for a very long time and uh, finally can get a crate in every single color. Uh, allows you to do more decorations. Maybe you have like a warehouse or something like that. 
you've now got a lot more options to decide, you know, what type of crate you want to put in your warehouse. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> I mean, there's not really much to show about it. Like, you go in here, you pop in. Uh, you see, as you can see, you can't actually put these um, into the crate there because technically, if you were allowed to, then you could create some really deep nested. You could create some really deep nested um, items. Um, so yeah, we can seal it, break it open. There you go. <laughs> Bob's your uncle. Who is Bob? I will never know. Anyway, on to the next change, and uh, we're up to what these the, these two here are actually brand new pieces of furniture. So before we do actually open these up, if you guys are enjoying Furniture Friday so far. Do not hesitate, go ahead, snap that like button right now. And if you want to keep up to date with all my latest, uh, all the latest Furniture Friday and all my other videos, make sure you guys remember to go ahead and subscribe and turn on your bell notifications as well. That last step is the most important step, turn on the bell notifications. But anyway, let's get back into this right now and uh, let's reveal, let's open up these two remaining crates because we have two new pieces of furniture. Alrighty, the first one here. In three, two, one. Boom! What is it? Ow. Ah. Ah, my hand. Ah. The pain. I actually did. I like scraped it on my table. That's how you, that's how you, that's how you catch a ligma. The piece of furniture we are looking at right now is the modern table. The modern table, my dude. So I wanted to add in, you know, some... I've been doing like a lot of kind of modernization to a lot of the existing furniture. However, I actually wanted to add in kind of a completely new style of table. And if we go ahead and we take a look at this right now, have a look at this thing. So um, this is actually a table that has four legs compared to the table that is actually already in the furniture mod, which if we have a look at this one, it's a table, but it's got like the uh, kind of support beam right in the middle. And instead, this one actually has four legs. And of course, this table can extend as well, just like the other one. So if you have a look at this, that is the uh, original table. Let's do it with this one here. So as you can see, we got a table going like this. We can create a square table. And then we can also create a table like that. So as you can see, this one's looking a whole lot more modern than this one because this one just kind of uses the wood textures, it uses the stone textures which, you know, does keep that kind of Minecraft feel but it doesn't have that modern feel so I've added in the modern table and uh, maybe you guys can guess what the next piece of furniture is going to be because, you know, it wouldn't be a table without... alright, keep that thought, keep that thought let's head over here, let's open up the last crate a modern chair have a look at this thing and this is a completely brand new model as well it's kind of based off the actual chair that was already in it but you'll see that when we actually place this down this is actually a really actually let's uh do it so there's kind of just a glitch with my shaders where it kind of renders this black sort of gradient here i'm just trying to find a spot here it is all right so have a look at this my dudes this is the modern chair, and I actually really love the look of this thing. So basically, the, the legs here actually go down at the front, and they go around like this, and then they go back up. It's actually a really cool looking chair, and as you can see, it's also got like these kind of slight angle pieces on the front here, and also on the backrest as well. And that's kind of the same with the modern table as well. You'll notice that the corners there actually kind of have this little slight angled piece just to kind of make them feel, I don't know, it just made them feel more modern rather than, you know, a cheap table. Um, so yeah, you can actually create a really nice kind of dining table with these, minus the kind of black gradient that uh, is displaying on it. It kind of ruins the whole feel of it, but you can go, of course, sit on these as well. So if you just right click on them, uh, we can, uh, <laughs> oh, what the heck? I didn't even mean to do that. Oh, what the heck? Why am I Steve? I didn't even take notice that I wasn't my my uh, main account, but uh, what we're going to do now is actually we're going to head back to my... Actually, oh, hold up, hold up, hold the phone crayfish! So, I wanted to come back to the modern couches here, and maybe you've got an, an idea of why 
the textures of these have changed. And the reason is because of consistency. Um, usually when I do kind of these updates, I like to make all the furniture feel, you know, they're actually kind of grouped together. So if you actually take a look at, you know, at, you know like for instance, the bathroom furniture, uh, you'll see that, the, you know, the toilet, the basin, the wall cabinet, the bath, the shower, the bin, they all use the same textures. Um, let's have a look here. The kitchen stuff, they all use the same textures. Same with the bar stools as well. All the textures are the same. And this is kind of the reason why, you know, you know, the modern chair here. This is the modern couch. This is the modern chair. We have the modern table. So as you can see, these group together very, very nicely because of the texture changes. So it's a, it's a positive. So if you did look, I know like the other texture did look good and I'm not going to lie, it did look good, but I wanted to make it consistent and uh, it's kind of something that I've always done in the furniture mode. You might, you guys might not have noticed it, but I've always done it in the furniture mode. Alrighty, let's head back to my mansion and uh, what we're going to do is actually install some of these modern chairs and modern tables and uh, maybe the mod oh no the modern couch already would be installed if we actually take a look at our office real quickly let's see what actually happened to that what happened to my office because it must have it must have updated uh -oh. all right <laughs> mr sheep um oh yeah they did have a look at this so now we've actually got the uh the new and the kind of the modern couches here with the new texture um maybe we could um Oh yeah, let's replace this, let's replace this, because this is kind of looking a little bit ugly. Let's create a proper poker table here with the brand new modern couch. Alright, and let's also get out the green carpet, place that on there. Oh yeah, that's a proper poker table now. That is a proper poker table. We could also create like maybe like a kitchen table. I oh, know, we don't really have any space. Mind you, we could put like a, put like a little one in the middle here. Oh, look at that! We have a nice kitchen table in the actual kitchen here. That works perfectly. So as you can see, this modern table and modern chair works perfectly for any modern kitchen. For any modern kitchen. That's actually... I love that. I really love that. So that is pretty much it for this Furniture Friday. However, I do have some final words. Next week, I want you guys to expect a modern coffee table this is something i wanted to do this week however i didn't really have the time to implement it so i've kind of pushed the uh, modern coffee table back to next week so essentially it's actually just going to be like this table but shorter but it's going to look really awesome and it's going to allow you to create you know more modern looking you know living rooms like this and i definitely think my gaming room here needs the modern coffee table so look out for that next week and uh, if you guys do have any suggestions or maybe have an idea of what the next update to my furniture mod could be because I need to have an update after this, you know, we're almost getting to the end of the modern update. We need some more updates to come in the future. So if you have any ideas, please do let me know. But that's going to wrap this video up today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Furniture Friday. This update is now available. Link in the description below. If you guys happen to play around with this mod and uh, decorate your house with the brand new furniture, do not hesitate to send me some screenshots. You can find my social media in the description below and uh, I'll potentially feature you on my feed. But if you haven't already as well, make sure you snap that like button right in half, subscribe and turn on bell notifications and I will catch you guys later for some more epic videos. Peace out!